There's a new warning about flu season and why doctors think it could be especially bad this year. Flu cases are rising, but there's also a new higher dose vaccine to help keep older Americans safe. Mm -hmm. Brianna Dahlquist gets answers to the questions so many of you have about how to protect yourself and your family. Good morning. Good morning, Dave. That's right. So many questions, but doctors say the answer is simple. Don't wait. Go ahead and get vaccinated against the flu today. Kids are returning back to school and adults are returning back to the office. Something else is back too: the flu. As COVID restrictions ease, flu cases are on the rise. Who spoke to local doctors keeping a close eye on the numbers? One city in Alabama reporting more than 250 students recently out sick. Everyone should get a flu shot. In New York, cases already widespread. The state health department releasing this reminder. We need to prepare for both flu and COVID this fall and winter. Nationwide CDC data shows that cases are 13 times now than around the same time last year. So what's behind the rise? NBC News sat down with senior medical correspondent Dr. John Torres to get answers. We've been wearing masks, we've been staying away from other people, but now we're not doing that. How bad will it be? You know, we think this is going to be a bad flu season. So who should get the flu shot? Everyone six months and older, pregnant people and seniors. But there is something new this year, a stronger type of flu vaccine that the CDC is now recommending. So what are those high dose vaccines and who should get them? So the high dose shots are particularly recommended for those 65 and above. It's stronger in their body and it gives that immune system response that can help fight off the flu. Seniors should ask for that specifically. And for anyone wondering if it's OK to get flu shots and COVID boosters all at once. It's safe to get them both at the same time. It's not going to double your symptoms from getting the vaccine. More than likely, you're just going to get a sore arm, feeling under the weather. A push for protection now to keep you safe all season long. But I have to mention, too, that doctors are now recommending that if you've recently tested positive for COVID-19, please wait at least three months to go ahead and get vaccinated against COVID-19 or get that booster. Maureen? All right. We all know the drill after a couple of years of this, but it's definitely time to pay attention. Brianna, thank you.